In this video, we're going to learn how to use the sleep function in Python to temporarily pause the execution of our program. So the first thing we'll do is import the sleep function from the time module with from time import sleep. Then we'll output the text program start with print and then the string program start as an argument. We'll also output program end with print program end. And in between, we'll call the sleep function. So here we'll have sleep. And we'll pass the function to as an argument. This will pause the execution of the program for two seconds in between these two print calls. So we'll save our program and try it out. Here we'll have python3 and d.py. And we'll get program start. And then two seconds later, program end. We can try it again. So we get program start. And then two seconds later, program end. So the sleep function will pause the current thread of execution for the number of seconds that we pass as an argument. And we can pass a float number as an argument to have the thread pause for fractions of a second. So for example, we could pass the function 0.5. And now the function is going to pause the thread for half a second. If we save the program and run it, now we'll get program start and then half a second later, program end. We can try it again in case that was too quick to see. So here we'll get program start and then half a second later, program end. We could also use the function by importing the time module with import and then time. If we do it this way, we'll have to have time.sleep here to use the function. We could save the program and try it again. And again, we'll get program start and then half a second later, program end. We could call the function inside something like a for loop to pause the execution of the program with each iteration of the loop. So for example, we could have for i in a list with the integers from one to 10. So this loop is going to run for each integer in this list. And each time it does, i is going to be set to the next integer in the list. And we could have here print i. So now if we save the program and run it, we'll get program start and then the numbers from one to 10 and then program end. But we could call sleep inside this loop. So here we could have time dot sleep and then one. And if we save the program and run it, now we'll get program start one, two, three, and on. And each time the program and the loop is pausing for one second after outputting a number. So this is how we can use the sleep function in Python to pause the execution of our program. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.